The New South Wales Government's Shark Management Strategy was implemented in 2015 by the Department of Primary Industries in response to an increase in shark incidents in New South Wales. The strategy includes a range of new technologies, including smart drum lines, VR 4G shark listening stations, aerial surveillance using helicopters and drones, as well as tagging sharks to understand their movements and presence close to shore. Smart drum lines are vastly different to traditional drum lines. They are designed to alert operators when an animal is caught, allowing rapid response, including releasing marine species alive. Relocation of live sharks further offshore after capture is a procedure that has been successfully used for several years in Brazil and South Africa. Smart drum lines are deployed approximately 500 metres from shore, weather permitting. They are baited and positioned away from swimmers or surfers. When a shark is hooked on a smart drum line, an alert is sent immediately via email, text message and phone call to the Department of Primary Industries, shark scientists and contractors. The shark is carefully pulled to the surface. An acoustic tag is inserted, as well as a satellite tag if conditions allow, before the shark is relocated and released offshore. The dorsal fin tag helps to track the shark using satellite technology, while the internal-external acoustic tag can be picked up on the network of shark listening stations across Australia. Acoustic alerts from the VR4G receivers are immediately broadcast via the SharkSmart app and at New South Wales SharkSmart on Twitter. Short-term data has shown that when sharks are captured on smart drum lines and released, they move well away from the area they are caught and don't return in the short or medium term. Some sharks have, incredibly, travelled huge distances in just a matter of days. In one instance, Shark 28, a 3.06 metre male white shark tagged and released off South Ballina Beach on July 5, 2016, has travelled more than 13,000 kilometres to Western Australia and back to New South Wales in just 10 months. Other sharks have travelled to South Australia, while several others have crossed the Tasman Sea to New Zealand and back. The long-term data obtained from tagging, releasing and monitoring these sharks will help the New South Wales Government understand the underlying factors of shark migration and will hopefully assist in identifying potential times and areas of increased risk to water users. Due to the overwhelming success of smart drum lines to date, this year the New South Wales Government is rolling out additional smart drum lines to take the total used in New South Wales to 100. This will be undertaken in consultation with local communities. For further information on smart drum lines and other components of the shark management strategy, visit the DPI website.